Hey, hello. Hello. It's room at one again. And today, I've decided to um, expand a little about, um, about the 32-bit audio thing. Because apparently, apparently, fuck you. <laughs> apparently, a uh, huge portion of the internet does not know about the intricacies of 32-bit audio and 32-bit uh, internal uh, processing in a door. <coughs> so I've got my pattern 88 here. I've got a serum loaded, and we'll just test what a 32-bit recording uh, does to peaks. So I've got my Edison here, just set it to record, and play the pattern. It's pretty quiet, so... Here's what this serum saw wave looks like. That's what it's supposed to look like, yeah? Everybody remember these little peaks and notches here. That's what it's supposed to look like. So, if I were to crank this up, seriously crank this up, let's say it's at 50% volume right now, so I'm going to go to 80%. Right, 80% volume. Forward. Ooh, that's, that looks pretty clipped. I have a limiter on the master, by the way. So uh, your ears are protected uh, a, a little, at least. Yeah, that is clipping. Look at that. What do we do with that? Can't you that fucking saw wave anymore? Unless this is a 32-bit recording. So you press Control N to normalize. And voila, the peaks are still fucking there. What kind of sorcery is this? Not actually sorcery. It's because 32-bit does not clip above zero, uh, above zero dB. Like, I think the technical limit is plus uh, 1,600 dB. So I can crank that even further like this and do the carnage thing. I don't know what this does, but let's crank it. All right, so record. Now, actually that should like, if it is 32 bit audio clipped, like usual, uh, like 24-bit audio. This should sound like a, squ uh, a square wave, a perfect fucking square wave. Look at this. This can only be a square wave, but it still sounds like a saw wave. And the reason is because we're in 32-bit audio. It still sounds like a saw wave. And if I hit normalize, we get the same saw wave we had earlier. Wow, this is magic, you guys. Absolutely magic, right? So, um, I don't know, maybe you found this helpful. Maybe it, um, maybe it cleared up some things for you, uh, or it, uh, <laughs> or you're, you're still mad about the fact that people, um, People do these kind of things, um, like send samples to you in collabs that are over over the zero dB limit. Huh? But I don't know. Um, like for most samples, if they're if they're thirty two bit, you can hit normalize, and usually the peak information is still there, unless you have something in the chain that limits before or clips before. Um, yeah. Perfect fucking square waves sometimes aren't perfect fucking square waves. Just wanted to say that. Thanks. Goodbye.